uh, in a sense, uh, where does SMU fit in within the university landscape in Singapore today? At the last IAP meeting in uh, September last year, I think the uh, one uh, very, very important observation was made by the IAP members that uh, uh, the Singapore education system, which had been essentially uh, developing uh, uh, steadily for the last, uh, from 1980 uh, to uh, 2010, 30 years, had reached a level when essentially it's, uh, it's, it is matured. So the IAP said that in a sense of all of this, Essentially, you have a complete university landscape. There's sufficient variety for students and their parents. There's sufficient variety of courses. There is competition, uh, and uh, and essentially, as I remark at the press conference, uh, uh, <coughs> what the IAP was telling us essentially that you have run out of people to uh, learn from. I think we used to learn a lot from the US, uh, from other countries, but our university sector has now reached a, reach, reach a level when uh, essentially the ISP conclusion was that uh, <laughs> the easy part is over. Right? When we started SMU, we look at what Wharton was doing and we just transplanted it there. When we started SUTD, we look at what MIT was doing. Which was here. Now you are at the stage when who do you learn from? So. Uh, uh, my conclusion from the IAP's uh, remarks and so on, <laughs> we have now earned the privilege of uh, making our own mistakes now.